Hey guys, here is a quick tip. Uh, I absolutely dislike the fact that you have to go from object mode, uh, to you have to press tab, and then if I want to be in vertex mode, I have to press one. And now I have to leave by pressing tab again. And let's say I want to switch to face mode now. So I have to press tab again, and I'm still in vertex mode, so I have to press free. It, it, it's so annoying. Uh, this interaction with the tab key is uh, super uh, stupid and I, I really prefer how it was in Maya so I'm going to show you how to achieve the same thing and I think you will get used to it and it's going to be much less buttons to press and it's way better in my opinion anyway so you go to edit preferences key map uh, you can either make your own thing like I have my this is my main one intense hotkeys but you just click the plus sign if you want a custom one or you can just directly edit the blender one uh, but what you have to do is you go into 3d view uh, object uh, object mode uh, wait which one wait 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 uh, yeah object mode object mode global and we scroll down and we must uh, delete all of those so I'm just gonna expand this one to see that I'm uh, not uh, Clicking this one, unchecking this one, thinking it's this one. So <laughs> make sure. So that one, 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 that one. And the last one, the zero. Uh, this you still need, uh, control H, uh, but the others you don't need. Um, okay, so after we do that, we're gonna add a new hotkey. And we're gonna type here object dot mode underline set underline with uh, sub mode object dot mode underline set underline with underline sub mode uh, I'm gonna write this in the description so yeah uh, I'm gonna copy paste this because uh, we're gonna use this a couple of times and we're gonna go here mode uh, and you're gonna choose edit mode be careful there's two edit modes you don't want this one this is with the grease pencil something else uh, you want this one the, the the bottom one edit mode okay we're gonna choose vertex and we're gonna press one and we're gonna hit repeat okay nice add a new one expand paste the same thing edit mode press two edge mode repeat add new paste edit mode free and we select face and repeat okay cool so now uh now if we are uh, in object mode i can just press free and i'm in directly in face mode i go back to object mode and i press two i'm directly in uh, uh, edge mode i'm in object mode i press one and i'm directly into vertex mode it's much 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 quicker and one more thing i absolutely dislike pressing tab it makes no sense to have tab there if i press one two three as buttons i want tilde key to be uh, object mode and I don't want this uh, stupid interaction tap 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 see with tab I go into edit mode and object mode it's like a toggle I don't like that it's it's stupid okay so let's see where is that uh, it's in 3d view so expand 3d view and you scroll down object non-modal okay and here you have see tab and uh, this you expand this one set object mode and you're gonna do this uh first we select tilde key so the the left of one on the on the keyboard and uh, mode object mode okay and we uncheck toggle because we want it we don't want to toggle between back and forth okay so save preferences and here we go so now if i now if i press tilde key you can see here nothing happens so if i want to go into uh, vertex mode i just press one bam i'm in vertex mode and i press uh, tilde key to exit back to object mode so free face mode tilde key back to object mode you, you don't have this stupid interaction with uh, the tab key all right hope this was useful if uh, you want more quick tips videos like this uh, let me know peace